Hello everyone, it's Yvette from Polished After 60. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. If you're new to my channel, thank you for stopping by. And um, just to let you know, my channel discusses topics for the mature woman, age 60 and over. And I go through topics such as fashion, beauty, style, um, a little bit of everything. So if uh, you look at the video and you think you're interested in subscribing, please hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. For my subscribers, thank you much. As always, I appreciate all your comments. And um, M, thank you. I hadn't seen you for a little bit, so thank you for the kind remarks that you sent. And you guys, uh, I couldn't wait any longer. I had tried to delay this video for a little bit and I just couldn't wait any longer. I received a Talbot's uh, catalog about two, maybe three weeks ago, and it was chock full of winter ideas. And the hues that they have for winter, this upcoming season, is just beautiful. I think I had mentioned it a couple of times. As you can see by the cardigan that I'm wearing, they're just lovely. They look like spring. It looks like spring in a, in, in, in a box of clothes. I don't even know what else to say. But anyway, for my first look, I have paired this turquoise cardigan with a checkered blouse. I got this blouse from Belk a while ago, and it's uh, purple, turquoise. The cuffs are black, and I, I really like this top. And I just put on a pair of mom jeans and then the little cardigan. Paired it with some uh, slingback pumps. They're pointy toes, it elongates the leg. And um, I hope you enjoy this look. You're gonna see, I've, I've included pictures of their catalog so that you can see the array of colors that they have um, for this coming winter season. They're just lovely. So anyway, um, let's see what I, else I have for you guys. Thanks. All right, guys. So here I am using the same lovely hues, these um, lavenders and teals and blues. This is a Jennifer Lopez top that I had in my closet. These are Isaac Mizrahi jeans that I'm wearing and I topped it all off with a leather jacket. So I just looked in my closet um, for items that I had using the pretty colors that are out this season. And by shopping my closet, I think I came up with a good representation of uh, some of the looks that they're showing. So I hope you're enjoying this. Let's see what else I have. All right, ladies. So all these cute plaids um, that we're seeing underneath little um, sweatshirts and sweaters are very much in style. And even with these colors that are kind of associated to springtime, all these aquas and pinks. So um, here you go, here's this style. I've paired it because the blouse or the sweatshirt is a little bit on the loose side. I paired, with, paired it with a pair of skinny jeans. The shirt is from Talbot's. The little sweatshirt I got from Ross. And these are little um, boots that I purchased from Carlos Santana. And we still have very much the Western influence in the shoes. So there you go. All right, let's see what else. All right, guys. So here I'm showing another look for you guys. And uh, these colors are really being used this winter. We especially see them in Talbot's winter catalog. And this shirt that I have here is actually a shirt that I purchased from Talbot's. Um, I'm trying to decide whether I like it or not. You might show it or you probably will uh, see it um, pop up in a little Talbot's haul that I have coming, but um, it's, it's beautiful. These colors that are being used, these mints 
and purples are just lovely. So I'm pairing it with a pair of black jeans, a pair of black booties, a little vest that I am repurposing because a lot of the vests, the little puffer vests or that they're showing have these little faux fur collars. And I just repurposed from a, uh, a jacket that I had that had a removable fur uh, collar. So I placed it on an existing jacket that I have. And this is what I'm showing you guys today. So I hope you enjoyed it. Let's see what else I have using these beautiful hues. All right, ladies. So I'm picking up on that pretty amethyst color that we're seeing, those soft lilacs with a striped shirt. It's a classic um, button-down shirt in uh, this lavender and white um, stripe. I paired it with an old logo cardigan that I have that picks up on the same color. And there is a little bit of a chiffon trim at the bottom that has different shades of lavenders and blues. So I've paired it with a pair of straight legged uh, blue jeans. Pointy toe um, leather black sandals or, or flats or pumps, I guess they would be pumps, and just a little clutch that I'm carrying. And actually, do you guys have a go-to when you go out? So my go-to outfit or uniform, if you will, is I wear a pair of slacks or jeans, a shirt, and I usually put on a little cardigan, or if not a cardigan, a kimono, or something on top of it, just to give it a little bit more polish. Um, now, in this Florida heat, I will tell you that sometimes I go out with just, you know, a jean skirt or a pair of jeans and a light tee, but um, when I want to have a more polished look, um, I tend to dress it up a little bit with a cardigan or a blazer, and um, that usually is my look. So anyway, guys, I hope you're enjoying these looks. Let's see what else I have. All right, guys, so I think this is probably going to be the last look for today. This sweater is from Talbot's. I purchased it in one of my um, hauls that you might have seen. And I'm pairing it with a little silver uh, vest, puffer vest that I have in my closet. It has the little Sherpa um, lining that is being used. I paired it with a pair of gray jeans and a little pair of boots. And I added this little purple bag. It's kind of in the same hues. It's not gray. And a lot of tone on tone is being used. And I think it's nice when we add a little bit of color uh, when we dress head to toe in, um, in the same colors. So I think it goes because it's kind of in that same dusky hue as the vest and the colors in the sweater. Um, these boots, I did want to mention, they're by a company called Le Artiste. Le Artiste. I don't know if you're familiar with them. You can probably look them up online, but they just have beautiful shoes and beautiful boots. They have um, a little bit of artistry to the shoes and boots that they make. And for instance, this little uh, boot has a little bit of flannel, uh, well, it's actually like a wool on the heel of the of the boot, and it's a little bit of a plaid, and the buckles are also very beautiful. So I thought I'd mention them in case you want to look online to see what you can find. So guys, thank you again. You might see the color off on this video, and I apologize in advance. Um, I have been filming it over the last couple of days, and we've been having some stormy weather here in Florida. We do have a, a, a storm coming our way. So I wanted to get it out to you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks again, guys, for all your beautiful comments. I just love to hear from you every day, and it, it really makes me smile each and every day. So thank you. Um, thank you. Bye. Have a good day, guys.